Hello, this is Vicar Dave from Holy Trinity Lutheran Church with your encouraging word of the day. These words from the book of Leviticus, chapter 19, verse 17, were part of my readings today. You shall not hate your brother in your heart, but you shall reason frankly with your neighbor, lest you incur sin because of him. As our cities and towns continue to be overrun with the strife and destruction, let's not forget that the match that set off the explosion of protest was and is hate. The hearts of sinful men who choose to treat others harshly have been given over to sin. Moses spoke about this in the law to remind us that conflict can and will only be resolved when we see each other as brothers and sisters and we reason with one another as equals. We see a lot of images of protesters in the media. Last night on News 12, cameras caught a group of angry people standing on the sidelines of a protest in Merrick, mocking and berating the protesters to go home, go back where you come from, and much, much worse. This is like pouring gasoline on a raging fire. This is hate that perpetuates the conflict we see in our nation. Psalm 1 reads, Blessed is the man who does not walk in the counsel of the wicked, nor stand in the way of sinners, nor sit in the seat of scoffers. But his delight is in the law of the Lord, and on his law he meditates day and night. Be careful where you walk, stand or sit, and with whom. Be careful of what you think about and what you do. Let us pray. Father God, we live in a sin-sick world that needs the healing hand of Jesus. Give us the boldness to defend what is right, fight against what is wrong, and pray for those who stand on either side of conflict. In Jesus' mighty and magnificent name we pray. Amen. May the peace of God give you rest this evening.